if we are talking about the prosecution of cases, it does not fall within the yes. first. It is with the fiscal office. Our job as lawyers for PDEA is to ensure that our offensive, that our final cases are both within the bounds of the law. No? Um, there is a move, actually move lang, that uh, the legal and prosecution service from PDEA would be um, granted the authority to not only file cases, but to prosecute cases exclusively like this is lang. Fortunately, it did not push through. Um, as of now, for the whole region of Caraga, there is only one lawyer covering the entire region. So, um, we have been raising this issue in Congress that the competitiveness of the salaries and the um, benefits of PDA lawyers should be increased. Because um, for the past three years that I have been here, there have been applicants. However, when submit the application papers, they would hear that the PAO, the fiscal, that even the DNR are offering more, more um, beneficial salaries and um, benefits to them. I fear that for the next years, you will be stuck with me. So that is the problem with um, our organization now because one lawyer would take charge five, six provinces. And under 9165, kasi, an operation for uh, 100 drug operations, we are only given 36 hours to file the cases. Otherwise, automatically, no matter how big or how huge the amount of confiscated drugs, wala, dismiss lahat yung mga cases. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Again, another thing that, have, that, that had a very huge impact uh, yeah. to uh, anti-drug operations is the this animal they call free bargaining. Free bargaining. Free bargaining. Free bargaining. I know everyone here has heard of free bargaining. It is when we apprehend one a person for selling, but under the free bargaining arrangement, he can plead guilty to only yes, section sir. twelve. Yes, section twelve is only punishable up to from six months and one day to four years, plus a fine of 10,000 pesos only. Compared to Section 5, life imprisonment, and a fine of 500,000 pesos. Notice the discrepancy. If you will be, if I will be, God forbid, if I will be apprehended for selling drugs, I would automatically plead guilty to Section 12. And in one year, I can apply for probation apply for CDR, CD, uh, community based drug health program. I can go out. This is what happens to this target here. I have monitored this case because when I was, um, I first reported here, this is one of the big, big names that I have encountered. Unfortunately, nakapli bargain siya eh. So nakalabas. That's why he engaged again in this, um, this business. For our part, PDEA has always been filing its opposition. Because in court, they, when they would file their application for pre bargaining, we are required to comment. When I arrived in uh, Region 13, it has been my um, SOP to always file an opposition to the application. Even if I know that my opposition our opposition would be just be disregarded by the courts. Yes. So yun, ang pinakamalaking problema that we are really facing now is the benefits that these drug personalities are given under the pre bargaining agreement. Okay. Well, actually, there's no problem with the idea or the law enforcement side. It's the wheels of justice. Yes. Uh, ang pagtuyo sa ligid sa justisya na kayo sa ay maplatan man o ay pagpulkid 
So, mga kung may kabok, let's say, may isang tapta sa korte, no, hearing, ang problema kay si Mr. Bangway, si transfer sa lain region, kung sa akong pag-attend sa investigador sa hearing, or sa arresting uh, plenty officer, so to the point that the case will be dismissed. So, that's a mere technicality on the part that one. So, but then again, magsugod niya, masadyot lamang ang PDEA o ang MPNP within the 36 hours. Mm -hmm. Kung di kayo nila ma-inquest niya pa, ilan na na sa problema, ilan na saya. Pero once may isang anda o may suyo na sa fiscal niya, kuya na sa ina. Pag-abot na lang sila ng schedule hearing kung let's say nag-preside ang fiscal's office that yes, there is a probable cause na isa ka. Uh, it, it, it could be an opportunity for us na because of what happened now and then usahay lagi na na masayang na ato operation because of uh, loopholes within the justice system now we can call on uh, request uh, or on uh, our good congressman sa Jaume's committee on dangerous drugs na to ano to support the a bill or an amendment to the law na para to increase the powers and uh, and the uh, judiciary uh, capacity to prosecute and ato mga na na takpan na mga kwan na, na mga suspects and uh, para sa mga sustain sa tumong sa tulong ni uh, ni Nicole lagi na usahay lagi po kay ipasa naman sa fiscal or may ipasa sa sa lahi na na ahin sa lahi na ang pagtagal di sa sa mga zoom zoom ikaw ang naghagot tapos masaya ng rin ng nan uh, masaya ng pag-abot dito sa lahi na pag sa lain na proseso, so marazal na doon na sa tuntana na, na pagdako, tutog sa pagpapundi. Uh,